Wow, it's kind of kind of hard to follow that one. Um, <laughs> well, I'm Demetrius Curry, uh, co-founder of Collegies. Before I start, I just want to say I want to thank David because David called me the other day, and I was stressing about what to talk about. And me and David talked, and he said, "Just tell your story." That's not something I do often. So, uh, yeah, I'll, everybody has to excuse it, about to have a moment of. Uh, <clears throat> unfilteredness. Um, the people who read in the program about colleges, you, knew what we, you know what we do. Um, we help kids go from high school to college. Yeah, we're growing. We're in a couple countries. That's great. The people who really know me know why that's a passion. Um, we design colleges to help the kids that I used to be. Um, I'm originally from the south side of Chicago. Uh, I went through every messed up experience you can probably say in a stereotypical environment. Uh, child of divorce, ended up being homeless at 14, living in group homes at 15 and 16. Um, <laughs> dropped out of high school three months before graduation with a 3.6 GPA just because there was nobody there. Uh, boy, I don't usually share this. Um, ended up going into the Marines. And after the Marines, went to college. And so we're like, well, we were talking about the whole, you know, all the themes of everything, um, being a legend through adversity, the crucible. We, I've lived that life. You know, it's funny because when you're doing a startup, you hear all the same terminology, lean startup, lean. <laughs> you don't know lean until you've been homeless and you know how to make a dollar stretch for a week. <coughs> you don't know it. Maybe that's what makes us good at what we do. But it also is the passion for why we do what we do at college ease. I got great people around me that share the same vision. My co-founder, I don't even know where he is in the room right now. There he is. When I first told him that, hey, I got this crazy idea, I want to help high school kids everywhere, everywhere, find a better way to get to college. And he was like, well, that's cool. We both work with kids. He was like, so what made you think about that? Every day, 7,000 kids drop out of high school. Think about that. And I was one of them. So if I hadn't dropped out of high school that day, it would have been 6,999. But it was a motivating factor. Why do we grind the way we do? Because I was that kid. So when Walter is talking about the value of education and honoring his parents, I understand. The promise I made to my mother was that I would get my degree. I have a company helping kids get their degrees. I'm getting mine too, so that's, you know, that promise is honored. Every day I grind, but not just for my parents, not just for the team around me, not just for anybody else, but for everybody here in the city of Columbus that believed in us. So anybody that's ever met us and gave us kind words, understand, people like myself, Walter, and every other entrepreneur you saw up here, we grind and we keep hustling because of y'all. So you see me in the suit, and people who know me laugh because I'm always in the suit, but you know, I never told anybody the real reason, so I'm gonna share it with you guys. Because one of the first things somebody told me when I went from being homeless to starting things, dress as if, act as if. So I do, every day. I bounce around the country a lot. And like Walter, I found a home in Columbus. I've been in Columbus for exactly, <laughs> wow, um, like 12 years now. It's the longest period of time outside of the military I've ever lived in one city. And you would have to pry me out of here with a, with a crowbar. You know. <laughs> so once again, I'm a, I'm a wrap up, but I really, Thank David and the entire Civic Hacks team, Startup Storytellers team. Um, I was scared to come up here because I typically play the background. I do. 
you know, people say, you know, people need to know about what your company does and everything else. No, that's cool. Just know that we help kids, you know. So thank everybody for coming out tonight, and that's my story. <laughs>